We have a shocking update to last September's fence jumping incident at the White House that cost the head of the Secret Service her job. You may recall that U.S. Army veteran Omar Gonzalez, carrying a knife, eluded both the Secret Service agents and trained dogs as he made this mad dash across the White House lawn and entered the executive mansion through the front door, of all places. Only when he was inside, far inside, was he actually stopped. Federal prosecutors are now asking a judge to send Gonzalez to prison for almost two years. In part because of what you're seeing on your screen, mind-boggling the array of weaponry that was found in his car at the time of this incident. CNN senior White House correspondent Jim Acosta joins us now with the details. Jim, when you look at page upon page of photographs that the feds have actually right. issued that he had with him, and it's not the first time he's been found with caches of weapons that are somewhat similar, I don't right. understand why the recommendation is as low as it is. Can you help me through this? I think that's an excellent question, Ashley, and, and there is an answer to that question in this court filing from the U.S. Attorney's Office in recommending the sentence of 21 months uh, in prison. They do also request that Omar Gonzalez uh, be forced to undergo three years of supervised release. Uh, and during that time, they're saying that they want to see this uh, Army veteran uh, get treatment for his post-traumatic stress disorder. At one point, it says in the filing, Ashley, uh, that uh, Omar Gonzalez did not make sufficient efforts to s consistently obtain that treatment. Uh, so they're asking for the maximum period of supervised release to ensure that he receives that treatment. And all you have to do is look at those photographs we've been showing on screen, uh, this arsenal of weapons that was found in his vehicle after he was uh, caught uh, jumping the White House fence and entering the White House. So remember, this was last September. Uh, he was inside that White House for, uh, for a decent period of time, managed to get past Secret Service agents uh, to, to really be inside the White House for, for a disturbing long period of time.